World Press Freedom Day is vital. We all recognize that a free, unfettered, objective press is absolutely vital for the well-being of every citizen everywhere. Reporters aren't out there to go and say the world is coming to an end, but just to say, here is what is happening, whether it be our in, what we do by our individual actions, our purchase decisions, or what is being done you know, by companies and governments. An informed populace is our you know, first line defense. The importance of world press freedom for me exists at the intersection of two different quotes. One I hear a lot at J School, and that's that journalists are writing the first draft of history. The other I learned a few years back when I was reading Chinua Achebe, where he said that until the lions have their own historians, the history of the hunt will always glorify the hunter. The combination of these two ideas is especially why it is so critical that we allow people access and we protect the right for people to tell their truth. Without that, we will allow injustice to happen in the dark, and we will never be able to create the world that we want to see and live in. Hi everyone, this is Doolin Tu, Professor and Dean of Academic Affairs at Columbia's Journalism School. My office overlooks the lawn at Columbia, where for the last few weeks, protests and protesters have gripped really our campus and really the, the nation and the world. Uh, when the police came in to clear out the encampment, uh, our students were here to report. When the gates were closed, our students got stories out via text, via video, via audio, and it really underscores the importance on this World Press Freedom Day, the importance of a free press, the importance of the free press to democracy. So uh, grateful for all the journalists out there and grateful for the work that you do. And again, World Press Freedom Day uh, really is a reminder of how important to our democracy a free and active press really is. Freedom of the press means being able to report without the fear of persecution. And without a free press, democracy dies. In studying journalism and reporting in New York, I really admire my professors who set the precedence for me. Everything that's been happening on campus these past few days, it really reminded me of how important it is to get that kind of coverage because I've been really wanting to know what's been happening. So the fact that the press is there and that the press is free to do what it needs to do uh, really means a lot. So we want to say thank you to those journalists who look out for us and help inform the public. And we want to encourage all of us who benefit from their work, which is all of us, to continue working to protect their rights to do so. Thank you.